Man, listen, welcome, everybody, welcome back to Pino and me. So, y'all know the deal, man, I, you know I mean, I really don't have a computer right now, so I'm going to do this from the phone because I wanted to stand here and bring y'all some new information today because I found some stuff that's really, really interesting, and I figured y'all would might enjoy it a little bit. All right, so, MAGA communism pushed forward by Jackson Hinkle. This is a super interesting idea, right? Um, I'm not a communist, you know, I mean, in any way, shape, or form. So, like, you know, don't don't take this the wrong way. But I wanted to bring you the points because I'll be honest, this is kind of like a wish list for the American working class. So let's have this conversation and check this out. All right. So, all right. Number one point: reindustrialization of America. Well, y'all know me. You know what I mean? I've been pushing for this for a long time. Of course, you know what I mean? I'm from the Rust Belt. You know, things are what they are here. Shit's fucked up. The fact that, you know what I mean? Like the common man doesn't have a place he can work straight out of fucking high school is an issue. You know what I'm saying? Number two, dismantle big tech. Can't say I argue with this one. You know what I mean? I've always said I have no idea why they allow uh, fucking Alphabet to hold Google, YouTube, and I think there's like two or three or four other ones. And I mean, the Play Store and all these type of things. It seems like it's fucking wrong. You know what I mean? It's like Facebook owned an Instagram, <clears throat> Twitter owned and fucking Periscope. There's a lot of these Amazon owning, you know what I mean? Uh, uh, the Amazon Web Services, right? It kind of fucks things up as a whole. And foreign intervention. Man, listen, you know... <laughs> Completely and utterly and 100% agree with these things, right? And global imperialism, man, listen, yes, right? Abolishing the CIA, FBI, and NSA, 100%. 1 million percent, yes. Drain Department of Justice swamp, yes. Pardon January 6th protesters, 100% yes. Uh, pardon Assange and Snowden. Again, 100% yes, you should never, you know what I'm saying, kill the messenger, right? Highly important. Extend free speech to social media. I miss our old days. I really, really do. <laughs> yes. Land reform, dismantle big agriculture. Yes. <laughs> 100% yes. Uh, unite with China on BRI. I'm not 100% sure what that is, so I can't really say yes or no. I'll, we'll look into that later. Ban Antifa street terrorism. I mean, maybe, you know what I mean? That's kind of one of those things. Maybe, right? You know what I'm saying? Expand stable, high-yielding energy oil slash nuclear. Yes. <laughs> Leave NATO. Yes, that should have happened back in 1992. NATO was set up to fight the fucking Soviets. The Soviets don't even fucking exist anymore as a whole, right? Mass infrastructure program. Maybe, uh, I mean, I, maybe, you know what I mean? Like, yo, that would kind of depend on what that mass infrastructure was. Declare major, major energy sources as public commodities. Basically, the principle there is, is that everybody gets a fucking check. Now, I don't know. You know, I mean, that, that's that's up and down for me, right? Banking in the hands of the people. Uh, I mean, really, right now, the banking kind of serves us, right, as a whole. And I know a lot of people think that it doesn't, but the truth of the matter is, is that like really what the banks do is they're standing here trying to allow boomers to retire, right? And which has caused a lot of problems. And we blame the banks on this, but like we kind of charged them and told them, hey, look, we want you to stand here and, you know, like be able to allow, you know, 60 million human beings to be able to retire comfortably that way it's not on the backs of our shoulders right you know because social security really isn't that much right so i mean maybe which frees up our companies not to have to pay for pensions because that was the reason why the decision was made so i don't know right economic bill of rights 
maybe, right? Depending on what's in this Bill of Rights, I'd have to kind of like see it and then decide then. You know what I mean? Because I'm a, I'm a details guy, right? Cut the military budget? Uh, yes. Protect the Second Amendment? 1,000% yes. Cut foreign aid and democracy promotion? 1 million percent yes. <laughs> no open borders? A, a quadrillion times yes. <laughs> Dismantle the military industrial complex? Uh, yes. Promote made in America products? One million times yes. Nationalize big tech? I mean, on one hand, I do want to see, like, the tech people kind of all lose their mind and, like, fall apart, right? I want to see people jumping out of windows in Cerrito, California. On the other hand, I kind of don't want the government involved in me trolling. <laughs> as long as I'm allowed to troll... And they're not going to fuck with me. I don't have a problem with it, but I feel like eventually they would have a major issue with me trolling. <clears throat> so, I mean, I'm going to go with a no on that one, right? Literacy movement. I don't know, right? I, I don't know. Patriotic education and woke academia. Maybe. <laughs> that's a big fucking maybe right you know what I mean because like the last thing you want is like a little kid to turn into like the fucking Nazi youth you know what I mean like yo, you don't really want them going well you know my dad said that you know like the government's a piece of shit and then you get a knock at your fucking door that you know what I mean that's iffy right and subsidization, uh, subsidization of monopolies uh yes <laughs> right remove red tape yes Subsidize gyms in every community. Yes. <laughs> Lower taxes. Yes. Deport Bush family, Clinton family, Obama, Pompeo, Bolton, to the International Criminal Court. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Destroy Open Society Foundation, WEF, IMF, World Bank, Gates, Ford, Clinton Foundations. Yes. Dismantle Big Pharma. Yes. <laughs> you know, 100% yes. I mean, like, oh, that's going to cause, like, us not to have, um, I I guess you would call it, like, a lot of, like, forward, uh, forward moving of our medical industry. But again, I'm kind of fine with that. You know, I mean, I'm good with it. Like, the rest of y'all are going to fucking hate it. Destroy duopoly DC Uniparty. Yes. And debt slavery. Yes, 100%. Like, yo, as long as we can get rid of child support is one of the first parts of that. Imprison opioid slash fentanyl networks. Yes. <sighs> Protect minors from sexualization. Yes. Dismantle secret society, CENTCOM, AFRICOM. Yes, right. Declare NED, USA, and NAFO terrorist organizations. Uh, yes. Last one. Arrest George Soros, Klaus Schwab, Bill Gates, Fauci, and all Epstein associates slash criminals. <laughs> it's QAnon meets... <laughs> Yo, know, it's QAnon meets, like... I, I don't even know how to call this. I mean, like, I'm down for all these things, right? Like, you know, and again... <sighs> We need a new name for this. Like, legit. Again, I think the Leave Me Alone parties like, way better. But, like, you know, I'll be honest with you. You know, like, I'm I'm down for most of this shit. Like, 100%, right? But then again, like, you know me, man. I'm, I'm a weirdo when it comes down to stuff. And I like to think. So, tell me what y'all think in the comments. You know what I mean? Like, we can have this conversation. Actually, you should probably, like, do it in the comments and come in the Discord. You know what I mean? Like, Discord links in the old fucking, uh, whatchamacallit, right? And we can talk about things, you know what I mean? Like, freely without having to worry about, like, YouTube, you know, doing what we do. <laughs> so, yo, look, y'all know what it is. Like, share, and subscribe, motherfuckers. I will holla at y'all later. Peace be like one. I'm out.